Hello, everyone, and welcome to the the drafting challenge that uh, I hopefully uploaded on my channel uh, that, of all the rules. I don't have to explain it all the time, but I'll explain it again anyway, just for the lols. Uh, what we're doing is we're prestiging one, two, and three on every killer, and I've decided to pick, you guessed it, uh, the spirit. <laughs> Not the clown. <laughs> I, I'm going to do the clown, and my reasoning behind it is the clown's probably one of the poopy killers that don't do so well, mainly because his power isn't that great. The only thing he's got going for him is that he can walk really fast, that's about it. But anyway, I'm going to put the time right to, right there, over in this part of top of the video. So if you want to go to the gameplay, skip right to the gameplay, but if you want... To stay and listen to me uh, pick up perks, do that. I speed it up. I even have, I speed up me uh, going through all these perk, perk choices so you can see which perks I'm getting. And uh, then I'll try and make a build out of it. I'll try to explain my reasonings why I want to do a certain build the way it is. But this is something I want to start, like, yeah, at the start of every one of these challenges, for Killer at least, is I'm going to try to find which perks I want the most. And on the top of my head, I want Enduring, Spear of Fury, because those are the top perks for M1 killers like the Clown. Um, Devour Hope would be awesome. It's not needed. In fact, Devour Hope usually is garbage and usually gets destroyed in like a minute. You'll never be able to get the tokens in time. I usually only use it for the three token part. The five token part, I just kind of ignore it because it's unrealistic to assume that you'll get it. Um, there's Hex Ruin, which is a cornerstone of all killers. Uh, barbecue as well is pretty much a cornerstone of all killers. And uh, ba Bamboozle is really amazing on him. Brutal Strength is amazing, particularly on the clown because he can destroy pallets really easily. His power, in a nutshell, is I'm going to reduce one loop. I mean, I'm going to reduce a loop, which normally could be circled three times, to one. That's his power in a nutshell, like on its base level. And uh, it slows the survivors down, but I have trouble. Like, it when you do it out in the open, it doesn't seem like to do that much. I don't know. It just it looks weird when you do it out in the open and not in a loop. It just feels like if I just ran him at normal speed, I would have gotten him at the same, at the same time as me throwing a bottle at them. Uh, his gas also makes you slow vault uh, windows, which is pretty amazing. Not pallets, though, I think. But anyway, those, that's enough for that, so let's get started. Cue the root skip music. <laughs>
that's it. Um, I, I'm a little bit disappointed with all the perks, to be honest. Like, uh, I did get Bamboozle, but that's already in his kit. But level 3 Bamboozle's definitely a must for uh, all these good... Oh my god. Okay, so we got Devour Hope, we got Make Your Choice, we got level 1 Ruin, which isn't gonna do... Not gonna do anything, I believe. I, I'm not gonna trust it with a 10-foot pole. Uh, barbecue and chili is, a uh, okay. I mean, at level one, it's, it's terrific, actually. It's, everything you want in barbecue and chili is, the, the good part about barbecue and chili is that it's always the best part is the, <laughs> fuck! The best part about barbecue and chili is the aura reading part, and that's the, the same at any level. It's the higher levels you get more blood points, which would be, you know, pretty nice to farm them up. But, you know, whatever. Um, I'm gonna do Hex Devour Hope, and then make your choice. Because he needs the insta-downs. Bitter Murmur is also a great choice, and I kind of want to get rid of Bamboozle for it. Actually, I'm going to. So we got two aura reading perks to help us locate survivors the best we can. And then we got two insta-down perks. So that we can uh, down them a little bit faster. I'm not going to run no ed for, for any reason. Like, I don't think I would. I don't really like running it. Like, I've run it, like, once or twice. Only for, like, running it with uh, no ed, devour hope, and play with your food and whatnot. To get that max movement speed. I like playing no th like that. But no ed just gives people a reason to rage at me. But they rage at me no matter what. Because they always perceive I'm camping. But anyway, let's get to it! I also want to mention that I don't use add-ons or offerings, that's why I never like even talk about them. I barely even know what all of them do. I have like 1.5k hours. Kinda sad that I can't like Enduring or Spear Fear or anything like that. I got Brutal Strength 1, but I didn't think it was worth picking over Burden Murmur 3, I think. Wow. You just ran into a corner of the map, okay. <laughs> you... What? You okay, Claudette? Okay, there goes my Devour Hope, which I didn't really care about anyway. I'm not gonna throw it. Yeah, I was just gonna clear out some of these pallets here. That's fine. Um, I mean, this side's probably gonna be the this side. I'm gonna camp a lot. They could do all the gins over there for all I care. Okay, a lot of people ran over to that side. Got to make your choice up on this distance. Does no one actually want to go save him? Okay, they decided to finish that gen, which is actually pretty smart of them. Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay, well, I'm gonna have to camp that side now. Unfortunately. At this side, it's a, a bust. There's someone working on that one. You can barely see it. Drop this, yeah. But now they can do gens on that side if they want. I'm gonna protect this side way more often now. Well, that just blew up the gen. I don't know why I took the long way, that was kind of dumb. I thought I could juke him out just a tiny bit. Alright. I wasn't scared of you dropping it. Hey, right, where's the other gen? Oh yeah, it's over there, okay. And he killed himself, okay. Cool. He ran up. I heard him go up. You know what? You can stay up there. I don't care. Never mind. Okay, nice. He went this way. I don't know why, but he did. And that's super amazing for me. And I know he had to drop down, so if, if he had bounce landing, it's gone. What? How did he not use it? I'm more confused about that, but whatever. I gotta get him, like, now. Get away from here. <laughs> Idiot save, whatever. A lot of pallets have been used, except for like that one. And I think that one over there. Like that one over there, I mean. You just like briefly saw it. I think Claudette was the one that worked on this for like this tiny bit. I just didn't get enough time to actually kick it. Like this map is brutal with survivors who have no idea like how, how to deal with this map. Like it's an H shape and you have to do gens on each side. You can't just, you know, go on one side and do the gen. So like all I have to do is like uh, smack people off these gens and if they run to a pallet I break it but then if they go back to the gen they won't have that pallet anymore. So it's basically game over. Like a lot of these pallets are gone like uh, all I count is these two and I think there's one still around here. Yeah. And the, the fucking 
Trap door is here as well. Oh, I can kick that if I need to. If a, uh, I can get them down. Yeah, they're not gonna win this. I think they basically just gave up. Yeah. I mean, he's, he's dead hook, but whatever. I'm not gonna chase him. Your guys' job to do gens, not mine. You guys want to run to the other side of the map? Go for it. I'll be waiting over here. Is this, this, I know, like, the end game collapse, like, just, like, it didn't just come out, but I wish they answered games like this. Like, this is a pure stalemate right now. They can't do any gens. They refuse to do gens, otherwise, whoever tries to, I'm just gonna kill. I also just realized my Discord's on, on my fucking screen, so I can hear myself talk, or I can see myself talk. I can obviously hear myself, fucking idiot. Yeah, they're too scared to come over here. They did all the gents on one side. I thought I heard that one actually be. They're all still still, so uh, your guys' move. I can stay over here all days. Probably not all day, but. Finally found one person, but I'm gonna run to the side of the map. I'm gonna chase her just because I think I can get her down. Did I drop it? No? Okay. I mean, not dropping that was a way bigger mistake. Now I know where everyone's at. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> got a dead hook off. He just did hard. Okay. There's no way he's going to be able to get a gen done, that last person. Yeah. Oh, that's not the guy that was dead hooked. Okay. Okay. Just trading a bunch of, uh... Book states for okay. going back to Jim Campen because uh, that that was a lot of time. I know like probably none of them were actually working on one. Like they tapped like these two gens, I think. That's about it. So uh, back to this. Yeah. Oh, that's game. 
I know where Hatch is at. I think it's like over there somewhere. I just see him crouching over here. I did! Wow. Wow, on the very tip of that, holy shit. Okay. Game. Where's this guy? Yeah, I knew he was gonna crawl to that. Yeah, this this game this map gave me an easy win, I'm not gonna lie. Like when survivors have no idea what gen placement is, games like this happen super quickly. Wonder if I can kick the uh, gen closed. I mean the hatch closed, not the gen. There we go. Hatch closed. <laughs> Bitches. Okay. Uh, it's an okay map, I think. Wait, do I know what this map is? Ah, oh, I don't like this map that much. This building's a bitch. It's just a huge gaping asshole. That's what that loop is. I missed that completely. I love how I went like that entire last game, like hitting them. Like constantly to just that. <laughs> I just, just threw it. Okay. I don't know why people go that way. That's such a dumb way to go. Okay. I mind game myself so hard. <laughs> The one gin I was hoping they wouldn't do was that one. <laughs> because of my devour hopes right there. Okay, um I learned that from true talent. <laughs> I learned that from true talent. I learned that I could do that. There's one over there. I don't know where the other ones would be. Like, look, look how open that is. Like, I'm not expecting it to last long, but every time I've said that, it lasted long. So I'm, now, I'm, now my hopes are going to be really dashed that it gets destroyed. Guys, almost done. Yep. And he has sprint burst. Nice. Let me delete that sprint burst real quick. What? Are you sure you want to do that? <laughs> All for it every time. I mean, not every time. I mean, obviously, there's better players that actually shoot that a little bit better. Like, she just threw it down. Like, when I was nowhere near it. Like, that's that's a sign of not a, a not so great player. Not making fun of her. I mean, she's obviously just has a lot to learn. That's it. Hi. Running straight for that gin, huh? Oh, life. Nice. But I deleted it a little bit. Ooh. What? I dodged that, but whatever. She didn't see me not break it, so uh, she gets to pay for it. Okay. 
I wanted to make sure I wasn't in uh, range of the barrel. Oh. Okay, so I'm gonna drop that. Okay, well, I'll chase after this girl now. I didn't mind finding another person. gonna throw everyone everyone down like that it's gonna be an easy game yeah she's just going to the next pilot since she's waiting at them perfect for me yeah do it okay i'll go after her next Is she dead hard? I can't even tell. Okay, so this is like no gen zone, so this is a great hook. Okay, one's healing in that crane. And then once uh, she gets unhooked, once I get further away, uh, I have a Devour Hope uh, Insta Downs ready. So healing does not even matter to me. Oh, she she was waiting on her to swim burst, which is an awesome play, not gonna lie. But I think she's also the one that's been using... Uh, Every pallet you can. <laughs> now I got insta down, but I mean, I'm probably gonna find it like right away too. That guy's looking for it, and that guy's on a gen, so I'm gonna go for the guy that's looking for it. Yeah. You know where it's at, don't you? <laughs> like no chins over there. Might be another three gen lock game, to be honest. Like, look at that. The gens are so close together. I don't want anyone destroying the totem, so I'm gonna try to avoid that. Okay, that person healed, so that person's probably dead on the hook. Okay. Like, they, like this loop is ridiculous. It shouldn't exist. Oh yeah, basement's over there, isn't it? Yeah. Kill you run from my totem, because why not? Yeah, 
And I know where Hatch is at now. He didn't scream, what the fuck? Oh, like Pump Spirit. Tried mind gaming me there, but uh, to no avail. That guy healed up. You'd be surprised how many people just mind game themselves like that. Um, oh, the hatches right here. I don't know where the hatch is at. I kicked this actually. Oh! Found you. Okay, well. I don't know where you plan on going. <laughs> I mean, you found the totem, congrats, but uh, you didn't win the game. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, man. I'm sorry. It just... I'm actually not feeling so well, so I kind of want to be cheery, but at the same time, like... This game was just like a game, I guess. Okay, she can't do the thing. There's no way I'm going to make it to the hatch in time, but... I can at least try... Of course, of course me trying actually made it. <laughs> of course I'm wrong! Why? Why do I have to be right? I don't have to be right. Well, that's... <laughs> that was the game! But the, those were two very quick games. I mean, not really quick, but the last, first one was not quick at all. It might be quick for you guys because I'm going to edit out like most of it. Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> No, no one laughs at that. No one ever even responds to it. I'm like, what? 